Amen. Praise the Lord. Today I'm coming from Luke, the fourth chapter, and the 38th verse. It says, Now he arose from the synagogue and entered Simon's house. But Simon's wife's mother was sick with a high fever, and they made request of him concerning her. So he stood over her and rebuked the fever, and it left her, and immediately she arose and served them. He stood over her and rebuked the fever, and it left her, and immediately she arose, amen, and served them. Praise God. You know, as I look at this, hallelujah, I see that God, hallelujah, glory be to God, has given us the ability. When he says, these works and greatest shall you do, he's given us the ability to rebuke, hallelujah, things concerning us, amen. Things, hallelujah, that exist on this earth that's not the will of God, that's not of God, praise God. He's given us the authority. When I see, he said he stood over her. By him standing over her, that represents the ability, that represents authority. He stood in authority. He took charge of the situation. He took charge, hallelujah, over, over the, the circumstances. He stood in authority whereby he had, praise God. And the Bible says, and he rebuked the fever. Amen. He rebuked it. I mean, he cast it out. He took dominion over, amen, that fever. He took dominion over that situation. And God is saying to you and I, praise God, that we can rebuke things in our lives. We can rebuke things in other people's lives. Praise God. Hallelujah. And That's letting me know that we can speak to it. Amen. He spoke to that fever. He rebuked that fever. He commanded that fever to come out. Praise God. Hallelujah. By the power and authority that was invested in him. And God is saying to you this morning that God has invested in you. Praise God. He is giving you the power and authority. Amen. To rebuke some things off of your lives to rebuke some things off of other people's lives. Hallelujah. Walk in that authority, praise God. Walk in that anointing and called it out in the name of Jesus. I rebuke it in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I rebuke sickness. I rebuke disease. Hallelujah. I rebuke. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Loneliness. I rebuke depression. Hallelujah. I rebuke it now in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. And when you rebuke it, praise God, in your authority, in your power that God's giving you, praise God, by faith, it shall leave. It shall come out. Praise God. It shall come out. But another thing it says, as he left the synagogue, praise God. So that lets me know he left a place of worship. Amen. He left a place, hallelujah, where he was in the presence of God. Hallelujah. So therefore, we have to know, amen, if we want to walk in an authority, amen, if we want to be able to to demonstrate, praise God, the power, amen, and the anointing of the Holy Ghost, praise God. We got to stay in that place, praise God. We got to stay, praise God, in the presence of God. We got to stay, praise God, before the Lord. Hallelujah. We got to have the higher she can see, continue to have fellowship with the Father, praise God, that he can, hallelujah, manifest his power through us, that he can manifest, amen, his anointing through us. He wants us to walk throughout this world, praise God, and he wants to have the power, amen, to rebuke praise God, to bind, praise God, to set the captives free by the Holy Ghost, hallelujah, in the mighty name of Jesus, God is saying to you and I today, <clears throat> he's given us the power, amen, to rebuke, hallelujah, to rebuke, hallelujah, to set the captives free, praise God, by the power of the Holy Ghost, in the mighty name of Jesus, hallelujah, do not continue, hallelujah, this path, praise God, without walking in that, in that authority, without walking in that power that God has given you. Amen. Don't tolerate it. Praise God. Hallelujah. We are, praise God, to be, amen, the salt of the earth. Glory be to God. So therefore, hallelujah, we have to walk in it. And so when we're encountered on day to day with different things and different people you run into with different situations, know that God's giving you the power to rebuke it off of their lives. God's giving you the power to rebuke it off of their lives. Hallelujah. You can rebuke it off of someone's life. Hallelujah. That that the devil have put up on them, that that the enemy has tried to try to take them out and destroy them with. God's giving you the authority and the power to rebuke it off of their lives in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. I love you and have a forever smile upon you. It's my prayer.